I absolutely would love to do a reaction to J-Hope's <clears throat> Jack in the Box album, like five hours away. As a matter of fact, I would absolutely, highly, 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 highly love to do a reaction to that album for many obvious reasons. Um, but it's extremely possible that I highly, 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 highly may not do it. Um, in fact, to be honest with you, I'm pretty sure I'm not going to do it because this is why. Yes. Did you know that I actually did a full reaction to the BTS Proof album? Of course you don't know. In fact, probably, no, not probably, 55 of you, really 54 would include me, um, 55 including me, oh, 54 of you only know that because only 55 people got to watch it before it was blocked. Not demonetized, blocked, as you can see. And I'll be honest with you, that, that hurt for so many reasons. As you can see, the video is well over two hours. And I'm doing this all off the top of my head. I think I can handle that. The video is well over two hours, so I can't even tell you how many hours it took to edit that shit. To like, I really I put so much into that video. In fact, here's a quick clip of just one of the many highlights of this damn of this damn reaction. Keep tapping, keep tapping. I told you, 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 I told you. I told you! Come on, man! Stop playing with it! Stop playing with it! I called it! I called it! I told See? Exactly. So that was when on came like I'm telling you, I was like giving insight like I usually do, and I had no idea what the album was about because I have this thing where I don't look at any track list for any album that I know I'm going to listen to because I like to be surprised. I don't want to know nothing about the album. It's like Jack in the Box. I know nothing about Jack in the Box except obviously it has a dark concept to it because I'm going to listen to it anyway. I like to be surprised. I haven't seen the track list. You know what I'm saying? I just want to listen to an album and hear freaking Jay-Z or Eminem just come rapping out of nowhere. Like surprise me. You know what I'm saying? That's one thing that I do hold on to today still um, in this internet day and age where we can literally see, we can hear the album before it comes out. I don't do that. I don't even look at the track list. So anyway, out man, that reaction to Proof came out so good. So good. I was predicting songs. You know, I was like, you know, I'm getting the idea like this album is about this and this is where they're going with this. And based off of that, I have a feeling that on is just going to come up somewhere. And then that shit came on and I lost my goddamn mind. No pun intended. So, and pun intended. So anyway, um, and here's the thing that the amount of hours it took to edit that footage to render that footage, which means basically bounce it from my video editing program to make an actual file that I could then take in YouTube and then upload it. And then the amount of time it takes to upload the, 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 the video. And then the amount of time it takes for YouTube to run a check. I'm telling y'all, I literally spent, it had to have been no exaggeration, a minimum of 12 hours of straight hard labor on this goddamn video and the crazy thing about it is i actually waited before i uploaded it for youtube to run their checks and it was all fine and then they blocked it after it released like them 55 views ran up and literally it must have been like an hour maybe two like it was and i may, and it may even be some likes let me check yeah i just had to double check 55 views and four likes and it did, and, and it was blocked after I released it and I put it out. And and I'm just being honest with y'all, that shit hurt. That shit, like I could totally understand 
uh, uh, putting the claim on it so you know I don't get paid for anything I get that that there's there's absolutely nothing wrong with that there's nothing wrong with that I just do it for the love I do it for the culture I do it for us I do it for the channel I did that for us you know what I'm saying? I don't really care to get paid on it. I, I know I don't own none of the guy, the goddamn music in it, so that's perfectly fine. But they didn't just claim it. They blocked it. You know what I'm saying? And it's probably, to be fair, because it was just so much copy. They claimed everything on that video. Whoever owns the rights to that music, I don't want to say no names. They claimed everything on that video. And it's probably because it's so much in one video, they blocked it. Because usually, they just put a claim you know what I'm saying? If I do a song, you know what I'm saying? Or, or something like that, they just put a claim on it and I don't get paid for it. My channel's not even monetized yet, but I, I, if it was monetized, I wouldn't get paid for it. They just put a claim on it. I'm like, okay, that's cool. You can take a claim, take the money. I'm helping you make money. I'm helping advertise your shit. And you know what I'm saying? Putting my own twist on it, my own commentary, and you know, giving people phenomenal insight to the project. But anyway, um, yeah, it hurt. I'm being dead freaking honest with y'all. That shit hurt my soul. It traumatized me. Just the sheer amount of time that I put into that video. And it was so good, man. It was so good. Like, I, I can't even... There's so many claims on it. I don't even want to start trying to get it unblocked. There's literally... Let me see here. There's literally... Like, look at this. Look at that, that's like at least 15, one, two, that's at least 15. That's at least 15 different claims, and it's all on the music in one video. I, I, I don't even know where to start with that. I have no idea where to start with that. So anyway, I'm, I'm rambling on, but, so that's the main reason why, you know, I, I'm likely not going to do a reaction to J-Hope. Um, I might look out for YouTube, but then it's a reaction, so I have to listen to it for the first time. Yeah. I'm sorry, uh, I'm going to just take the L on this one because I I'm just not putting that much time, that much, like, real energy, man. I put my energy in this shit, man. It's one thing to just run off of my mouth, but I put me in this, and I just felt like I was just robbed of that time, literally. But, hey, that's kind of how it goes when you're when you, when you trying to pursue greatness. You know what I'm saying? You're going to take them chances. You're going to make sacrifices. And it just happens sometimes. It doesn't always happen out the way you wanted it to. But, hey, anyway. I said enough. Um, absolutely love y'all. Absolutely appreciate y'all. Uh, you can check out my my, my, my video of uh, talking about the Jack in the Box album. I'll plug my J-Hope playlist in there. And it's Hobie time, baby. It's Hobie time. Let me stop talking. Why? Because it's Hobie time. It's all love. Boy, I hate, man. It's euphoria. You already know that. And I'll catch y'all in the next video. Check it out. Let's go.